Hello. Uh, I'm Mike. Don't let life happen to you. Make life happen. That's what you're here for. But right now we're in the monopoly phase. Mm. It's not a yes, not a no. Right, uh, but you're still in it. Yeah, I'm, I'm go still, in it. Yeah. still in it. Congratulations, Kate. Thanks. Yes. Hey guys, good morning and welcome to today's vlog. I'm Jill and this is It's the Donnellys. If you guys are new to our channel, welcome aboard. And for those of you who've been with us for a long time, welcome back, it's so great to have you. We are a family of five who loves to travel and have fun together and learn an adventure. And so as far as travel goes, we're traveling this weekend. We've got a lot of travel coming up, which is so exciting. We love adventuring and I, one of my favorite things to do is to plan up where can we go next? What can we do next? I remember, okay, this is kind of an interesting story and this has kind of formed my decisions on traveling and that kind of thing. I've, I've always, always wanted to travel. When Brennan was in elem uh, nursery school, preschool, um, he was in the twos class and I remember it was like, November break so he'd only been in there for a couple of months it was our first child in school all that stuff and I remember going going to the parent-teacher conference in November and she's like oh he's doing so great and he's well adjusted and he's learning this and learning that and the question I asked for, to her I said so what can we as parents be doing to like encourage his development and you know be a positive influence and everything and she said you know what Take him everywhere. Take him everywhere you go. Don't like think, oh gosh, I'm not gonna take him to the grocery store because it's hard to bring a child to the grocery store and go by yourself. She's like, you should absolutely take him with you. Take him everywhere you go. Okay. So we took him everywhere we went. And um, and we realized too that like for development and just the joy of life, it is just fun to go to museums and go on a hike and travel different places and learn different cultures and experience different sports and events and activities and all of it. So that's sort of why we do what we do and we love it. You know, we, we love just getting out there. I read a quote the other day and I hope that I don't butcher this. It said, don't let life happen to you, make life happen. That's what you're here for. So I absolutely love that. It does not work for me to just do the same thing every day. Not my not my thing. I like to get up, get around, travel, be out, doing stuff. So anyway, that's that. So enough of that. So to, today's a big day. We are going to um, Vermont, speaking of travel, tomorrow. Um, it'll be Katie and Ryan's first time in Vermont ever. Um, I used to live in upstate New York, so I've been to Vermont a few times, and I've skied, well, quite a few times, and I've skied Vermont as well, but this is going to be the kids' first time skiing Vermont. Now, Katie's not going to ski. Ron, Brennan can't come with us because he's got college stuff going on, so it's going to be our family and my brother's family and my sister's family, which is very exciting that we're taking our first, like, Hammer family ski trip. Stay tuned as we go. I'm going to go to the grocery store right now and get some stuff because I'm on the hook to make chili uh, for one of the dinners, and I'm going to go get the chili ingredients and we're going to have a salad and get all that stuff. The second thing that's going to happen today, and then I promise I'll shut up. The second thing that's going to happen today, I love talking to you guys, is Katie finds out if she gets into FSU, which is Florida State University. That's where Brennan goes to college. It is the number one on her list, and I shouldn't be making such a big deal about it in the case that she doesn't get in, but I'm really hoping that she does. All decisions come out today, so she's going to be hanging out um, by her computer this afternoon when she gets home from school and watching. So stay tuned to see what happens there, and say a little prayer for Kate that she gets into FSU, um, because that would be, we think, she thinks, um, an amazing experience. So anyway, but if it doesn't happen, there are plenty of other great opportunities out there, so no worries. All right, you guys, so I'm gonna um, concentrate on driving now and going to the gas station in the grocery store, and I'll check with you later. Yes, all right, you guys, this is my haul. It's not a very big haul, but it is the Whoa. things, includes things we're gonna be taking to Vermont. Oh, oh. We've got some snacks, Woo. some beans. We're gonna make the roasted cauliflower. Candy? <laughs> I don't have any candy no now. Candy. I do not buy there's candy. There's no candy here. No, there's a whole bag of like fruit and vegetables. And look at blueberries. Oh, Katie, look, I got you some protein, honey. Or the protein granola. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome. Oh, Michael, I did get you this. I know that you like this. That's not candy. Okay. <laughs> I could go and not get candy. Because uh, that's what I do. I go and not get candy. That's something for you to do. All right, you guys, so for dinner at... 
in Vermont, my dinner, we're gonna make these little Southwest chopped salad kits. I got five of those, because we have a lot of people. And we're making chili, so I always do my chili with turkey. Um, I still have to go to the other store because Sam's Club didn't have everything I needed. Your hair looks so pretty. Thanks. You're welcome. I love it. Thank you. Uh -huh. It's pretty. How was your day at school today? It's good. Yeah? Yeah. Fantastical. Welcome back. Thanks. All right, we're going to do our workout, I think, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, what are we doing today? Strength? Mm-hmm. Yes? Do you want to choose it or do you want me to choose it? Can you choose? Well, mm, okay. I don't know. Can you choose it? Yes. Kaden. Oh. She wears a Kaden and Kaden wears a Katie. So yeah. sweet. Ready? All right, you guys. One thing I forgot to about today is that Mike is getting a new computer. <laughs> Michael, when is the last time you bought a computer? How old is your computer? I, I know you're going to be embarrassed. <laughs> like 20, 2009? I have a vintage Mac. You really do. I'm going to look at it and see how old it is. It's really old. Here we go. Okay, here we go. A new MacBook Air for Michael John. <laughs> I'm glad it's not rose gold. Right? Mike almost so ordered rose gold. You gotta shake it a little bit. Got it coming. Here it comes. Here it comes. Try and name it. Yes. Uh, uh, <laughs> all right. All right. All right. Wow. Thank Michael. You. Awesome. All right. Look at you. I know. Oh. He Wait, did the favorite. You Mike, you're supposed to do that. That's okay. like the best part okay. of getting a new computer. Do you want to open it? Well, yeah, there like, we go. <laughs> Come on, I got to get out of here. <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> Look, you guys. <gasps> it starts up. Oh, yeah, take that off. Take that off. Slowly, slowly. <laughs> no. <gasps> Hello. Um, I'm Mike. Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Congratulations. Uh, Mike's computer uh, some, is in early 2011. Look at me, right? How do you know? Right there, it says. So it is 11 years old, Michael. You've been working on an 11 year old computer. It is about time. This is like NASA in here. We've got two computers hooked up to each other, trying to talk to each other, trying to share information. <laughs> do, 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 Nice, Mike. You look very important over there. Are you happy? Well, I don't know yet. Okay. It's a big change for me, Jill. It is a big change. You were reluctant to do this. Fingers crossed. But you did it. 2011, huh? So does that mean, what's this, 2022? It's 11 years. So it means it'll be another 11 years. Can you imagine <laughs> if it's 2033 before you purchase another computer? <laughs> wow. Good luck, Mike. Congratulations. Thanks, sweetie. It's 141. And which is early afternoon, Katie is um, keeping herself busy by folding tons and tons of laundry. Look at her cute little haircut, her new haircut. It's so cute. Yes. All those little curls she has. It's so peppy. I love it. Anyway, doing her laundry and we are awaiting a college decision from Florida State University. So Kate applied to Florida State if you didn't watch yesterday's vlog or a couple before that too. Um, I talked a little bit about this morning so you know what's going on. And now's the time. So what's supposed to happen is the call, the university said that they're going to be sending emails to everybody to let them know when it's time to check the portal. So basically they... Remember when they used to send letters? Yes, I got a letter. And you had physical, like, well, how else would you have found out? Yeah, that was it. And they could have called you or called us. They didn't. They sent me a letter. So we're kind of wasting time right now, just sort of waiting. Not this wasting not time. Wasting time. No, I've had busy work. I've had this laundry to do. For like months now. Yeah. Like I haven't seen these clothes in months. <laughs> well, good for you for getting it done. So any minute now or any hour now, you should be getting an email. Not Kate, a minute now. Kaden said we're supposed to know, like they're supposed to say it at four. Oh. But I think you just made that up because I have no idea where he got where that. Where he got that? From. Huh. That's interesting. Well, this is the thing too, is it'll probably be on your portal. They'll have to put it on your portal before they send the email. No, so I've been could... checking my portal all day. Oh, you have been? Yeah. Oh, Katie. Okay. After Katie's done with this, we're going to work out. I've got nervous tummy a little bit. What? I'm excited for. I've got nervous, excited tummy. You know when there's something That's you're excited? That's messed up. Why? That's messed up. Like nervous, excited? Like you nerve have, sighted? You have no right to have nervous, excited tummy. Oh, why? I'm for you because you know what? I'm your mom and like everything is like so exciting. No. I just want my little girl to be happy. No nervous tummy for you. Okay. Are you nervous, excited? No. No. What are you? 
anxious. <laughs> okay. Okay, you guys. Nauseous. <laughs> Say a little prayer. Tired. <laughs> well, the good news is you have a lot more clothes now. Congratulations. Thank you. I think the matching socks are in here somewhere. Oh, good. All right, you guys, we'll check back in. Once we hear something, probably. I'd like you to sit down and read an email that just came to your inbox. Actually, it How do you know it came to my inbox? Because I'm on here, but hold on. Because, sit down, there's one already. I have an email for Katie. Oh, I read that wrong. Oof. <laughs> USF. Yay! So she got admit, an admission email just now from a different college, a different university. That I've also been trying to wait for. Congratulations, Kate. Thanks. Yes. Hi, Kate. On behalf of the USF president, the board of trustees, the students, faculty, and staff at the University of South Florida, congratulations on your admission to USF for the fall of 2022 semester. Based on your academic record, you have demonstrated the potential to be, potential to be successful at USF. U.S. News and World Report's fastest rising America, university in America with access wow. to some of the best faculty, resource, faculty resources and professional opportunities available. Congratulations to you and your family. It's good to be a bull. Congratulations, <laughs> Kate! <laughs> Woo! Okay. Oh. oh, that's three so far. Nice work. Thank you. Mm hmm. Okay, we're cut. Okay, we're trying I to. I just got off the phone with Brennan, and he was like, I'll be waiting for a call. Okay, so apparently they came out. Oh. The decisions came out. Four o'clock? They're late? I don't know if it was four. I don't know if it was supposed to be four o'clock. Katie's supposed to find out. And she's, are you, are you calling Brennan so he can be on with you? Is that the deal? She's on my Yeah. Okay. But if Katie got deferred. It doesn't matter. It's too, oh. it's too separate. Oh, deferred? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, because he went for fall. It's, so it's that. It's too separate. Like, yeah. Like they're compared two separate yeah. people. Right, it's, right. Okay. <laughs> I'm talking right now. Yeah, I'll take that. Hi, Brennan. Hi, Mom. Does it hurt me? It means that it's accepted by a rolling admission in future date. Deferred. Oh my gosh. Really? All right. Okay. So it means they didn't say yes or no yet, right? Better late than never. Indeed. So when will they tell you? It says by April. It says we strongly suggest that you update your SSAR with first semester grades. Yes. Good. Okay. Rolling basis yeah. starting April and ending May 1st. Okay. Right. Okay. Not good, not bad. Can you say that again? Wait, start over. Do all the stuff that you're supposed to do, like, if you get, if you get accepted, like, um, like your SSAR stuff, like all your student reports and grades, like essay, like make sure that's all good. Reach out to your email or your guidance counselor and be like, hey, like what do I need to do like to stay on top of it? Okay. Good, okay. So there's still a chance. Yes, still a chance. So you're saying there's a chance. You're saying there's a chance. <laughs> Okay, Kaden. All right, so deferred. That's not a big deal. I know, but right? It's not a yes, not a no. Right, but, but you're still in it. It's, okay, I'm, I'm still in it. Yeah. Still in it. That's okay. 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 All right, that's good. That's good. Boy, right, make you wait. <sighs> okay, Kate. Hold well on. Still a chance. I got a large fry for myself. Oh, oh that was a good idea, Katie, because you always <laughs> like large fries. We well, always like fries, but you don't get large. Right. All right, you guys, so Chick-fil-A is our go-to spot for, well, when you go to the doctor or you hear that you got deferred from Florida State <laughs> or, I don't know, or you want to celebrate your birthday. Really anything. <laughs> right? It's just the best. Right. It's just the best. It's just the best. Brian, I like that you're wearing the hat. You're sporting the, um, you're sporting the colors right oh, there. Yeah. Oh, nice yeah. work. Nice work. All right, very good. So I think it's... All right, all right, all right. Here's, here's the thing. What's the thing? Wait, wait, no, these are fries. Uh, we go through uh, phases uh, at the Donnelly household. Right now we're in the Monopoly phase. Mm. Actually, Disney Monopoly phase. Mm -hmm. So uh, we've played two games of Disney Monopoly uh, in the past like week or so. And we're about to play the third. 
We decided. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So what are we going to do about our game? Should we write down where we are? Because we have a game, you, me, and Katie. Katie deferred the winner to me. I don't know how you feel about it. Yeah, that. I kind of think so. I mean, there was no chance I was going <laughs> to. Yeah. Congratulations, yeah. Ryan. Thank you. Okay. So now me and Katie both have a win, and Katie has no wins. Okay. Okay. All right. Katie, tonight's your night. Yep. Love you. Ryan is packing for tomorrow for our trip to Vermont. Let me show you what he's got going on. You're doing a great job here, Ryan. He has taken over Brennan's bed. Not necessarily Brennan's room, but Brennan's bed. Right. The full takeover is coming. Uh, full takeover. Right. Stay tuned on that. I think we might be doing a full takeover. Yeah. This is the laundry room, so this is all his laundry. Ryan, you have, do, have done yeoman's work down here. I've been working. So Holy I'm really God. excited to go to Vermont, as you can tell. Yes. Um, so I did a bunch of laundry, and I had, this is what I have packed right now that's almost finished. Okay. Uh, I need to put all that stuff away. Okay. This is my fit for tomorrow. Okay. These are uh, some of my... Wait, like, what's this? What is that? It's a pullover. It's, it's Brian's old pullover. Oh, okay. Yes, okay. I've got a bunch of stuff. Of Brennan, <laughs> and I'm not gonna lie, I like a lot of it, and I think I'm gonna might as well put it, it to use. Okay. Oh, exactly, but it's gonna sit here. Don't right. worry about These are my everyday gloves. These are uh, some snow pants. Actually, these are just like the insulated kind of oh, okay. pants. Okay. Okay. Uh, these are my skiing gloves, skiing beanie. My I put my ski jacket in here, ready to go. Okay. And behind here are like the ski boots and everything. Okay. Uh, these two or this blanket. Sorry. And this neck pillow are coming in the car with me. Perfect. And then um, I had a tape measure out because I was measuring that desk and seeing if it would fit in here. Not that I'd put that desk in there, <laughs> but if, if we could get another desk like that and fit it in here. Wow. Uh, You've and been then, busy. Uh, uh, shaved. Okay. Nice, nice. I had a nasty stash going. <laughs> um, you guys stay tuned. We have a big ski weekend coming up. I'm very excited. We leave tomorrow. Ryan and I are going to hit the slopes. So jazzed. Can't wait. I haven't even looked at the weather forecast. I hope it's going to be good. We'll see. Whatever yeah. it is. It is what it is, right? It is what it is. Excellent. All right. What made you happy today, babe? What made me happy today was preparing for all of this, really. And uh, just coming home from school and being relaxed. It really felt like a Friday today. That's awesome. All right. Very good. You guys, what made me happy today, too, was is is uh, getting ready for tomorrow, going shopping, preparing, and sort of getting in the mindset of going skiing on our ski weekend. And um, it was pretty intense today waiting for Katie's decision on Florida State. And I think it's actually, it's not a bad decision. It's, it's not a no, and it's potentially a yes. So we have a little plan on what she needs to send to school to, uh, or to Florida State to hopefully um, woo them. I'm happy that Katie didn't get declined, and I'm happy that we got Chick-fil-A out of it. <laughs> that was the highlight of my day right there. You guys, thank you so much for watching. Comment down below what made you guys happy today, and we will see you next video. Bye. <laughs> For the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnelly's merchandise, visit shopitsthedonnelly's.com. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.